So if you want a milker, first thing you need to realize is a lot of the higher production milkers out there now are right around a gallon a day. So knowing how many goats you need for your family and how it's going to go is important. And remember, goats, goats like to have a friend. So I, I, if I were running milkers, I'd probably run a pair. And that pair, if you're starting, gives you a chance to be able to kind of learn from two different goats, as well as it gives you a chance to, hi sweetie, as well as it gives you a chance to, um, as well as it gives you a chance to experiment with different goats in different systems. Having just one, that ends up being your one and it's very microcosmic as opposed to having two and paying attention to the idiosyncrasies and the difference. So you wanna make sure you have a decent producer. Now, if you don't want a gallon a day, you can get those cross breeds that are a cross with a mini and a full size goat and they're still productive. They're closer to three quarters of a gallon or a half gallon, that sort of thing. But you have to remember when a goat is at its highest level of production, it's gonna fall off over the year. So by the time it's had a baby and you're in January, you're probably gonna be getting about 60 to 70% of the milk you were at the very beginning. It falls off over time and then will kind of stabilize and you can milk them long term. But you want to make sure you're buying enough goats that you're going to get enough milk.